Thank you, Rupin. Money Works, you've probably heard of autonomous or self-driving cars, but what about autonomous drones? Well, they're very real, and a new company just decided to make Detroit their home. The name of that company is BirdStop, and their drones are designed to respond first. Imagine this, perched on cell phone towers, utility poles, government buildings, drones, ready to react when called upon. A true first responder that could provide intel to a fire, bridge repair, or an active shooter. We'd like to cut a little bit of that hazard out of the way by giving them real-time intel, by giving them eyes on the scene before they get there so they can plan their approach. This is all the vision of Keith Meow, who seven years ago in Alabama started the company BirdStop IO. We build advanced drone technology that's operated from, from hundreds, from thousands of miles away safely. On a global scale, he says America is severely lacking in the autonomous drone tech. Sure, we have self-driving semi-trucks, delivery trucks, and taxis, but when it comes to emergency response, that's the field he's trying to make America a player in. He says he's building them right here in Detroit and now he needs a workforce. To be able to revitalize American manufacturing through the product of drones, um, we're hiring and we, I think our roadmap is for hundreds of roles in the next couple of years. Meow says the Motor City just makes sense. Vehicles these days built in Detroit have plenty of autonomous features, self-parking, hands-free driving, etc. The plan is to have BirdStop tap into those workers along with forward thinkers at TechTown and New Lab. When it comes to manufacturing the drones itself, uh, when we looked around and we explored the Detroit ecosystem, there's really not a better place, maybe in the whole country, to do this level of manufacturing. The vision is that any department of public safety, no matter how remote, could use a BirdStop drone. No training needed. Where drones are perched up, they're on utility poles, they're on cell towers, they're on rooftops, um, and they're, they're activated when they're needed from hundreds of miles away from across the country. The CEO sees the drone not only as a tool, but like a partner, eyes that can go where you can't. And soon, you may see them flying above their new home in Detroit, deployed to help the new Gordy Howe Bridge assembly. As early as probably next month, some of our systems are going into the field uh, in downtown, some of our systems systems are going in that area by the bridge as well. During the grand opening ceremony, members of the military and FAA were on hand. The CEO says this only highlights the work already done to make sure everything is done safely and properly. Well, you heard him. He's hiring. So if you want to be part of the BirdStop team, you can find a link to their employment page over at fox2detroit.com.